Going? All right, guys. Today we're going to work on some uh, upper body takedowns. We're going to work on Greco-Roman. Greco-Roman basically means you attack the body, everything here and up. We're not allowed to touch the legs. In my opinion, Greco-Roman throws are the best for fighting and for grappling because when you take a guy down, you usually end up in a dominant position. As opposed to leg attacks, a lot of times you end up in the guard or in a guillotine. Our first uh, tie up here is a clinch. Basically, it's like a big hug. Put my hand on his elbow, right here in the back, and uh, great right here, that's the same thing. So we're both in a neutral position. We both can throw each other in this position. So once again, you just come in here, put your hands out. Right, right here. Who's been in this position before? Okay. So I'm going to attack uh, Greg with the double underhooks. This is what we're going to do. The steps we're going to take. One, we're going to take this hand, I'm going to pummel under his armpit. At the same time, I'm going to step in with this knee. So here, I got my knee in, I got my double underhooks right here. Two, I'm going to lift up high. You can lift them up on top if you want to. I'm in a good position. He can't do anything. And three, I'm just going to twist my body. And I'm going to turn to my right. Okay. Boom. Sorry, man. How about your knee? Yeah. Sorry, I'm trying to keep it. Twist on me now. So once, so once again, from this position here, the first step, I'm going to pommel under and step in. It's important you step in right here in between his legs. That's the danger zone. you got to have that control. So I have the double underhooks and the knee in. What's the second step, guys? Lift, and you got to lock your hands. And two, and three, I'm just going to turn. I'm looking back, see how I slowly turn? Just that torque is going to bring him down. Just that torque. So once again, we're in the clinch. But we're going to be fighting, both of us are going to fight, be fighting for this position. So as I come in, I pommel, and I step. So I have that one. Two, once I have this locked in, he's in trouble. And three, I just turn slowly. Boom. Leg control. You see where I end up? I hit side control. So Greg does it to me. Clinch. He pommels. He steps in, he jacks it up, and he's in a dominant position right there. And it's important, guys. I see a lot of high school kids do this. They come in here, they do this. What's, what, what am I doing wrong? Because if I don't step in, he's going to hit an army. Watch. Don't throw it. See, like, he's going to hit an army. What's wrong, guys? You kids get thrown all the time. If I put my knee in, try to hit an army. You can't do it because I'm controlling this. I got control. Or up here, or down here. That knee keeps me from getting thrown. Thank you, Jesse. Lance?